So you can give students examples of contracts, and here are some um, materials that will help you. Building that language, having students compare their own home and school speech. Students are better language learners than we are, because they're young and they're still flexible, right? They can build a grammar, building explicit knowledge, but having them really sit there and think about differences that they have heard of, and then you can add differences that they may not be aware of to the ones that they are here. So talking about this, you can use the terminology that you're most comfortable with, or you can even have students pick their own terminology. So it doesn't have to be about people's race, their ethnic background, their social cultural history. A lot of our kids we've been working with, they want to talk about their neighborhood. Like this is the language of my neighborhood versus the language of the particular school that I go to. Comparing sentences then in home and school language, writing assignments in different ways, right? So students can see those explicit examples. So our text has examples and as a reference guide. We've got a lot of the first text and we have a ton coming out in the second in December. 